Hi, this is Gotti from Salty Refez, bringing you another quick video. This, my friends, as you probably know, is a Jaboa DC 700. It's made by Jaboa and uh, under the new name J Card. Damn good skimmer. It has the super reliable. Jaboa DC 3000 uh, normal return pump with a different impeller fitted with a needle wheel impeller and what I have noticed with this skimmer it's very critical to water height and the adjustment on the the outside part of the, of the skimmer on the gate valve. As you can see at the moment, it's producing fat, thick, dark skim make, which we all seem to crave for. I think whether it's dark or light, you're still, you know, removing stuff from the system, but myself personally, I do think it works better if it's uh, a drier foam a dark foam. Now the control that is on full at the moment skim has been running now around uh, six weeks. As most of you know it replaced the eShops S200 cone skimmer and the only reason for that was the fact that I changed my plumbing and uh, I plumb orange everywhere so I basically wanted it to match. That was the only reason which I changed I was very happy with the with the performance of the eShops. I just didn't like the colour. Being a little bit fussy. I wanted to stay with the theme of uh, white and orange. That foam. Nice and dry, full of muck. And if you can see, dry, thick foam coming up from the from the spout there. Now, as most of you know, watch my videos and uh, watching my tank develop through the years, and it's now almost two and a half years old, um, two and a quarter years old. Sorry, my tank is a 
is very different than many others is the fact that it runs a very heavy bio load. I run a large different array of fish. I lost count of I many he's in there but it's definitely more than 30. And some will scorn and say it's overstocked. And what I will say is okay, bring your test kits, you will not find anything which is out of place. Everything where it's supposed to be and even better. I work really hard on the system. Now I've got the water changes down to twice a week. I either do five or ten on a Monday and five or ten on a Thursday, something along them lines. Tomorrow I'm gonna do twenty for the change. And uh, I'm now using the Aqua Forest probiotic salt, which I believe is amazing. It's made some, uh, made many different coloration changes in the tank on many different corals. Plus, as many may not know, my tank was a mixture before of SPS, LPS, softies, really softies. Now there are no softies in the tank at all. It's all SPS, LPS, um, with maybe a few zoanthids in there, but that's about it. I don't know whether you can see the tank now. It's in the moonlight light in the moment. So there you have it folks, if you have any questions on this great skimmer, feel free to ask and I'll answer every question. But again this is a Jaboa or J-Card DC 700 Coral Box Skimmer. Please subscribe, comment, thumbs up and when you're on Facebook Hop over to Salty Reefers to say hi. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.